after some events that has happened in the past in the Christian dom in Kenya, Kenya has decided to take a strong stand to regulate the churches. That is to say that anybody that wants to be a religious leader in Kenya must have scholar qualification. The task has been increased. It means the person have to declare their wealth and a whole lot of other things. And according to the news, they are saying that it should be an example to Uganda, that Uganda should follow suit. But truth be told, this is not for Uganda alone. This case study is for the, is for the whole of Africa. And it's not even just the Christendom alone. I think, in my opinion, every religion in Africa should be regulated. Regulated in the sense that one should have a certain qualification. One should be accountable. It's not that one person who did not succeed in career job or business or whatsoever will just run and go and open church because it's what is in vogue. And they will start using other people's frustration, exploiting other people's frustration, brainwashing people, putting fear in people just to make out of money out of people to meet up with their own frustrations. Yes, even the people that claim that they brought the so-called religion to us, they are not even crazy about it the way we are. Some of us are now exploiting each other, all in the name of God said, God did not say, and there's a whole lot of things. So I think the earlier the whole of Africa put a certain regulation when it comes to religion, have a way to monitor it, have a way to prove it, have a way to make these people accountable, I think maybe our people's brain, some of them will start resetting because when it comes to religion, some of our people, their brains need to be reset like where you are resetting a phone or a computer. Yes, there's a whole lot going on. You don't even want to imagine some of them. Some of these members have equally turned these people to them God, semi-God. Some of these people are now taking the glory that belongs to their children to be given a mere human being like them that are full of limitations. So I think the earlier African countries sit together, whatever religion it is, should be regulated. There should be check and balances. There should be a way to checkmate these people. There should be a accountability. These people should be transparent. They should be like a newspaper that anybody can read through them. Yes, because when it comes to religion in Africa, we have lost a whole lot of souls. So many people have, give, have given up their lives just because of a mere prophecy, just because of a mere manipulation, just because of a mere exploitation. We must put an end to this. Yes, if you really want to move forward, we can continue like this. For how long should 1% of us or 5% of us be exploiting others just in the name of religion?